It's always amazing what the MAC does in the fall, cross country, lots of regional runners, and how about volleyball? St. Henry and Coldwater playing for a district title in Division 3 tomorrow, Kaleida. Mark Shine and I will bring you that broadcast Sunday at 8 p.m. on WSN. Versailles will also go for district championship down at Clayton Northmont. And New Bremen's already won a D4 title, winning at Van Wert. Five of the six MAC teams that have already been eliminated have lost to MAC teams in the postseason. We've heard that before. Zach Keith tries to bring you that same kind of brilliance, putting together tonight's Leifeld Welding Top 5. Start this week off and running just like Shawnee did at Salina. The very first play, Ray Manley goes long to Jalen Bagley. Touchdown, Indians. Great play call by Frank Crea and his staff. OG fans brave in the cold, bringing some fire to the top five as Jake Hoffman keeps it on the Read option and he is gone 80 yards to the house. He had a couple of those long touchdown runs as OG hangs on for the overtime victory. Two overtimes over Elida. Girls District Semifinals, the three spot this week. Continentals Alex Hoffel puts on a clinic. Unofficially, she had about 12 shots on goal. Three that landed, giving her the hat trick. Here's two of those tallies for Continental. So far, we've seen a lot of offense in the top five. Sometimes the defense can make a spectacular play. Enter Caden Sullivan as Kenton's Trent Heights looks to the end zone. Look at this one-handed grab by Sullivan. What a catch. We needed the slow motion Lynchton replay for that one. And at the top spot, well, you probably already heard, so let's hand it off to our pal Aaron Matthews on the call. Their center, and he'll hand it off. It's a reverse. Julius Fisher, now a throwback. He's throwing left side towards the end zone. It's there. Touchdown, St. Mary's. Julius Fisher on the pass play. 